Hey guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and I'm very happy to bring you guys this video. Thanks to the dev team, Pod2G, Muscle Nerd, we now have an iOS 5.1.1 untethered jailbreak. Now this will work on all iPhone 4S, iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS models, iPod Touch 4th and 3rd gens, and the iPad 3rd, 2nd, and 1st generation. Now this does work on both Mac and Windows, and it is a fully untethered jailbreak, meaning if your battery dies, you no longer need a computer to reboot your device. Now this jailbreak is actually one of the fastest I've ever done and if you guys are currently jailbroken tethered from red snow from a previous jailbreak you want to go into iTunes and get a fresh restore so back up your device and restore your iPhone iPad iPod whatever it is make sure it is on a fresh restore that is unless you guys have never jailbroken before you can go ahead and go through with this jailbreak now if any of you guys are on iOS 5.1 or 5.0.1 and you want to update to get this jailbreak go ahead you can go ahead and update to 5.1.1 using iTunes and jailbreak on tethered using this method so no worries about getting stuck or anything unless you guys are unlocked now if you are unlocked on t-mobile's network you want to make sure you don't update as you will lose your unlock so stay where you're at if you're unlocked if you're not if you just want to jailbreak untethered on 5.1.1 go ahead and update through itunes and let's go ahead and begin so you want to make sure you download absinthe version 2.0 to your desktop and as always a link will be provided down below as well as a written guide but make sure your device is plugged in and let's go ahead and run absinthe and if it's not registering your device, just unplug it and replug it back in. But we're going to go ahead and select jailbreak. And that's all it takes, guys. From here, your device will be put into restore mode. It will only take about two, three minutes. So be patient, guys, and I'll be right back. Now, just a couple tips. If this jailbreak does fail for whatever reason, just go ahead and restore your device and start fresh from a clean restore. It will work. Or you can go ahead and try it on a different computer. But this jailbreak is very easy, very simple. There should be no reason for it not to work. Now, once your device restarts, that does not mean the jailbreak is finished. Just follow absinthe, and of course, it will tell you when your jailbreak is done. Once it is done, go ahead and slide to unlock and on your springboard you will see Cydia. Go ahead and open it up and of course there will be an initial setup. I've already set mine up but you guys are now fully jailbroken untethered on iOS 5.1.1. Now a big shout out to the dev team who made this all possible. Without them we'd still be on the tethered jailbreak so thank you and I would really appreciate it if you liked and favorited this video. It does help me tremendously and leave a comment down below if you have a question. I will try to get to it. Also so subscribe for future videos, future jailbreaks and unlocks. But otherwise, enjoy your jailbreak, guys. Peace.